Students and many caring volunteers, thousands of homebound senior citizens across our area will get a nice holiday meal. Yeah, it's really special, and some of Detroit's finest will help make those special meals on wheels delivery. 7 Action News reporter Nima Shafe joins us live from southwest Detroit. And Nima, I know it's early, but uh, you're at one very busy place. <laughs> You know, extremely busy. When you think about the fact that they have shy of 6,000 meals they have to deliver, over 700 volunteers that will be helping out on this Easter holiday, delivering meals to homebound seniors. And I'll tell you what, this is a live picture, if you will, of the volunteer table. Volunteers getting ready to go inside the kitchen right now. They're getting uh, gowned up, putting their aprons on. These are just people from all across Metro Detroit gathering here at the Meals on Wheels kitchen to, you know, create, you know, that, that guy's trying to talk, he's trying to get his uh, face, I'm trying to steal time from me, but joining me now, if, uh, if we can bring her in, is Letty Azar, and Letty is the Chief Program Officer for the Detroit Area Agency on Aging, and Letty, we're talking about this being a huge private effort, because during the week it's a bit different. Talk about the difference between during the week and on holiday. During the week we have local and federal funding to support our efforts. Our Holiday Meals on Wheels program is reliant entirely on volunteer efforts and private funding. So today we'll serve almost 6,000 homebound seniors in the Detroit area through the efforts of, of the public. And we're talking about a number of agencies coming together because in, in the past we've talked about Christmas, Thanksgiving, and other holidays. And, and you just told me this before we went on the air and I was pretty shocked. This is completely just people from all across Metro Detroit. Correct. It is indeed. We have some very reliable volunteers, too, that have been coming out. The program started in 1988. We have a handful of volunteers that have been supporting the effort since that. And so this is going to have, we're going to have uh, Deputy Mayor Mike Ike McKinnon. We're going to have the fire commissioner. We're going to have, you know, fire uh, the, uh, firefighters. And as well, there is a woman here, uh, a woman that is celebrating her birthday by volunteering. Correct. Yes, she has over 120 volunteers. This is her birthday party. Wow, and what a big birthday party it is. We are live just off Bagley and Rosa Parks Boulevard. This, a scene that's going to continue to keep on unfolding, and we're going to be here all morning long bringing you the very latest. And you know what? We might actually hop on a, a ride and go see what they do when they deliver the meals, too. We're live all morning long. I'm Eva Shafay on this Easter holiday. Back to you guys.